X tonight, a drug bust. Federal prosecutors are calling one of the biggest ever in western New York. We're talking about enough fentanyl to kill 4 million people. And it's all tied to the El Chapo cartel. Here's 7 Eyewitness News reporter Jeff Rusak. How many times have you eaten a sea cucumber? Never, right? Well, sea cucumbers were the critical clue that convicted these two men, Herman Aguirre and Troy Gillen. From 2013 to 2015, their drug operation brought in over 5,000 pounds of drugs to Western New York. Their source, El Chapo Sinaloa Cartel. We are a community of chicken wings and good neighbors. And today we took on the cartel and we delivered them a very deadly blow. These were just two of 15 people charged in creating phony seafood companies that were used to sell large quantities of drugs, including fentanyl. Gillen once had 10 kilograms of fentanyl in Lockport. That's enough to kill everyone in Erie County more than four times over. Police seized eight of these kilograms in Cheektowaga. The Western New York U.S. attorney says cutting off this drug pipeline made a big impact. If you're able to connect somebody or convict somebody at trial who um, had personal interaction with the head of the Sinaloa cartel, which is you know, one of the largest and most dangerous drug cartels in the world, I don't know if it's much bigger than that. It was one of the most successful drug operations ever seen in Buffalo. Nearly $19 million of drugs were bought. And thanks to sea cucumbers, less drugs are on the street. And these two men face a mandatory life sentence. Jeffrey Sack, 7 Eyewitness News.